You know, I think I wouldn't be wrong if I was to start to brag about the where I am right now as a Christian. Because listen very well here. I've been in a situation where in my early stages when I was beginning to grow spiritually, there would be people when things were falling apart, when I've been praying and things seems like my prayers are not working as I was growing spiritually, they would suggest, why don't you just go and do these things, consult and use these things, you know? And you find that those things, they contradict the Bible. I remember one person that I know even suggested, you know, in my family, we do those things. It's common in Africa where you worship your ancestors, you pour alcohol and all these things so that they can put blessings upon you. But I remember I was like, never. In my heart, there was something that told me that do not give up. I won't stop praying until God gives me a blessing on his own. I remember fasting. Do you, can you imagine fasting while you don't know God that so well? Well, you don't even know whether you're going to have a breakthrough. Fasting, praying, you've been told that when you pray, you, you always think that it's just going to happen like that. Because as a baby Christian, that is where we all start. We feel like only if I can give myself, I go to church, then God will start to bless me, bless me. We don't know there's a season where he first to train you to be strong and all these things. And But deep down, when things got worse, I remember stressing more and more. But when I've been stressing, something in me would say, I won't stop. And other voices would be telling me, do this, it's going to work, you will see. I was like, no, I will not stop until God Almighty does it himself. Until I have a breakthrough that is coming straight from... I don't know where I was getting this confidence or what, because I didn't even have a real solid record that God has done it for me before. And at the end of the day, let me tell you, I was proud because finally when God came through for me, things started to flow. And it trained me not to even stress about small things. Like my Christian level increased from that moment. It took time. It took, I think, even about a year when I've been going through those things. And right now, I want to tell you someone right now, just like Joseph, he went through difficulties. But finally, when God came through, the blessing just went like this for the rest of his life. And I want to tell you that like some people, some of you here, you have passed the test. Congratulations. It was not because things were not going to be okay. That was a test. And your obedience have unlocked your blessings. This was a good message for you. I pray right now, may God strengthen you, even those that are still going through tough situations. Hang in there and God will come through for you. I pray in Jesus' mighty name. Amen. Those that trust in the Lord will not be put to shame. Bye-bye.